Hello guys, in this video we are not riding to anywhere but I am going to show you the process of making a little library actually it's a public library that I got inspired from Pinterest there was one night I couldn't fall asleep so I was searching for some inspiration and ideas on Pinterest and then I found the little library which reminded me of someone who used to share about this project with me so I thought that it's the right time to make it happen so after waking up I asked my dad I asked my dad for help just want to find out if we have some pieces of wood left so that we can make this kind of little house storing books and he said yes and after a few days he finally made this one looking very good as always he is very skillful in his, in this kind of thing and i'm really proud of it so i want it to be in white color but we cannot just paint it one time so there were like as i remember two or three layers before we can make it the perfect white as you can see it takes some time. I spent like almost the whole morning painting this with the help of my daddy of course. And this is how it looks like after we finish painting all the side and even the inside. same day in the afternoon after having lunch I wanted to decorate it so I brought out some colors all kind of color that I have in the lockers and here's where we're gonna put it so first I color this I color some of the parts to be purple so it will be matching with the color of the paint that I'll be using to draw the letters on the side. And after that, it's time to write something on the roof. Here I wrote down the name in command in our language and also in English. I simply call it Little Library KH, which KH stands for Khmer, the name of our local language. And the other side, I try to do that with, with some random stuff like star, books, the eyes, the words like read, book, and so on. Here is the look of the name with only the English word. And then it's, it's time to write the main point of this little library or community library. It says here, take one, leave one, meaning that 
anyone can come here and take any book they like from the library but they have to leave one book it's like exchange book exchange so you can come with just any book you have at home and you feel like you don't want it anymore but in a good condition that other people can use and then just place it here and you can select the book that we have here as you may without needing to pay anything at all um, it's actually one of my wishes from long time ago and I am really happy to be seeing this happen in real life it was a really good day making our dream come true even it's just a small achievement but I can't have feeling excited whenever I see it And here's a um, simple quote maybe, but I, I think it's very meaningful. That's why I wrote it here. Read, learn, share, repeat. Hopefully that people coming here, they will continue reading something that they like and then they can learn from it. After learning, they can share to the other people and repeat it back. Just read, learn, share and repeat. Tada! Here is the final look of our community library. On the first day, there were not many books. But later on, I've been trying to select more books and put it here so that it can attract people. And the location is next to a coffee shop with this cozy environment. Hope that everyone can have a quality time reading their favorite books, having their favorite drinks, their favorite place. And they should be all for the video. Thank you for watching and hopefully to see you again in the next video. Thank you and have a nice day.